the European Union's Eurozone could be severed and collapse, according to a historian, who told Express that northern member states could form their own monetary bloc. Economic divisions have plagued the bloc during the economic challenges posed by the coronavirus pandemic. European Commission President Ursula von der Leyen presided over a deadlock regarding the bloc's economic response to the coronavirus pandemic. The bloc managed to reach an agreement two days later than anticipated after arduous negotiations. Leaders reached a historic agreement for a £675 billion, 745 billion Euros, coronavirus pandemic recovery fund on the summit's fifth day after tense disagreement. Dutch Prime Minister Mark Rutte had provided the strongest opposition to the plans on the table, which were said to have argued for a cap of £316 billion, 343 billion Euros, worth of grants, preferring loans on strict conditions. The Netherlands is one of the so-called frugals, a group of EU member states which has argued for smaller spending commitments. The split between these nations, mostly in the north of Europe, and the southern states, has led to bitter economic disagreements. Historian David Marsh told Express that the pandemic could provoke frugal nations to form their own monetary bloc. He said, sometimes crises lead to people coming together more, there's the old adage that Europe is forged in crises. But of course you can have a crisis too far, and some crises end in the whole thing, in this case monetary union, blowing up. I think both of these possibilities are out there, and it's difficult to tell which one is more likely. There is a chance the whole thing will come to an end, because the legitimate demands of the southern states won't be possible for the northern states to meet, which could conceivably lead to a southern state leaving. The northern states could even depart as a bloc. However, Mr. Marsh, author of the Euro, the politics of the new global currency, believes it is more likely the bloc could form a transfer union which would see wealthier nations support the less economically stable neighbors. However, the way in which this measure is implemented could have huge repercussions for the monetary union, he warned. Mr. Marsh continued, I think this is slightly less likely though than the other option which is the bloc forms a transfer union. Of the two extreme options, a euro breakup or a transfer union, both of those become more likely. The transfer union would be an expression of solidarity between the North and the South. The big question however would be whether this transfer union comes in in a fully legitimate way, authorized by parliament, and by treaty changes which would need referendums in some countries, or through the back door.